Howdy, this is my picture of an ecologist project for Ecology 205, Section 501. My project is over Henry David Thoreau, the father of ecology. Henry was born in 1817 to a modest middle-class family, the third of four siblings in Concord, Massachusetts. At the age of 11, he started to study at the Concord Academy, where he gained a base education. At age 16, he was admitted into Harvard College, where he spent the next four years studying rhetoric, philosophy, Greek, Latin, and other natural sciences. Henry's most famous contribution to ecology would be the way he lived. He spent much of his time outside in nature, appreciating every aspect of his environment. He spread his ideas to whoever would listen. He emphasized using and owning only what is necessary for survival, instead of indulging in the current societal fads. He kept records of his environment and sought to learn as much as possible about the natural sciences as he grew older. He was a mildly successful writer in his time. His works have grown to worldwide recognition in modern society for how valuable his thoughts were. I chose Henry David Thoreau as my ecologist of choice because I read the book Walden or Life in the Woods over this summer. It deeply influenced the way I believe we should interact with our environment. This book is a journal of his thoughts while living self-sufficiently in the woods next to a large pond. In the book, he goes in depth about the importance of each species in the wood and how they all work together to make the environment what it is. He emphasized the work it took to keep up with his farm by himself and how it was worth the efforts to live self-sufficiently. His philosophy about life was truly ahead of his time. He watched his hometown lose its forests due to the lumber industry and proposed that all towns should have large expanses of green space that are protected for residents to enjoy and that it would be wrong to cut down their forests and green space. Henry never called himself an ecologist because the term wasn't used back then. Instead, he felt the urge to study the environment and the way things interacted around him. His ideas still apply today. One of my favorite ideas from Walden was that the man that man buying new clothes without becoming a new man first is like pouring an old bottle of wine into a fancier bottle, meaning that we should address the way we are before we address the way we look. I would highly recommend this book and learning about his philosophy. Henry David Thoreau was truly ahead of his time and spent a lot of focus on the environment and how things work together. Here is a quote that I like by Henry, resign yourself to the influence of the earth. And here are the references that I used.